Commitment 2020 tonight, the opioid crisis remains a concern for many New Hampshire voters. So we asked the Republican candidates for the first congressional district how Congress can make an impact on that. Here are their answers. There's two, two things that they could do. First and foremost, support building the wall on the southern border. I can tell you from my time at the State Department, one of the first briefings I received was how uh, a lot of the illegal drugs are in our communities here in New Hampshire, come across the southern border and then make their way up to northern New England. Uh, so that's first and foremost. The second thing we can do is ensure that resources are provided for local decisions, such as Governor Sununu's hub and spoke model. But we need more beds available for those who are going and checking themselves in. It's a, a tragedy what's happening in our communities. And so those are two things that could be done on the outset, which would do a lot to help um, with our drug, drug addiction issues in our society. I think we have to stop the flow of drugs into our state. We need to finish building that wall on our southern border. We've got to stop the supply of drugs at the border. We also do need to stem the demand of drugs here in the United States. I think continuation of education, and I think opportunities to help people get off of drugs, stay off drugs, get back into the workplace. Those are all important components.